Hey everyone, I'm here in Slovakia. I'm about to have a nice fish for some trout and grayling on the Ravuchka River. I've got the pronunciation of that wrong, I'm absolutely sure. But uh, I've got some nice pieces of water ahead of me. I'm gonna have a little fish up with uh, my dry fly rod and my nymphing rod and uh, yeah, catch a few fish and have a bit of fun. All right, so I'm gonna start with a nymph and a dry just cause it's a lovely each, uh, each way bet. Um, the water's not too deep, so good for them from the dry. When I get into the flat water, I can fish a single dry or keep fishing this. When I get into a fast run with some more depth, I can go to a single nymph or a double nymph with more weight. So, yeah, we'll see how we go. Oh, geez, that fish ate the dry beautifully. I just didn't quite get it. And again. Got it that time. <laughs> Grayling. The first time, it rolled over the top. I don't think it even got the fly. Oh, that's a lovely fish. Whoop. Come here, buddy. There we go. That's why it's nice to have the... Uh, it's going to be painful to hold, as they all are. Why it's good to have the, uh, the dry fly option. Lovely grayling there. And it's going to flip out, but they've got the coolest dorsal fin like you can see there. Such a... Such a lovely fish, and he's gone. All right, we're back. That fish ate a nice split wing mayfly there. A good sign. I was surprised after I missed it the first time, I expected to, uh, to actually get the fish to eat the nymph, but it seemed to really want the dry there. Expecting that extra depth up a little bit further to be nice. Up in this corner. This pocket's not as nice as the top right one, but still could be okay. Got him. That was a lovely take. You would have seen the dry just shoot away. Another nice grayling. Ooh, there he is. All right, we've got some nice flat water here. Flat-ish, but I've seen a couple of fish rise up through here, so I'm gonna throw it, a, yeah, like that. A small little CDC dry at some of these fish and see if they'll eat it for us. Got it. What a beautiful take that was. It's a nice grayling. 
Calm down and swim back up for me, buddy. Look at that beautiful European grayling on the dry. And that fish has woofed up. Oops, sorry, buddy. I'm on quite light lines, so <laughs> let's scoop him on. Let's get this fly out. There's the little dry there in the side of the mouth. Thank you, mate. All right, dried that little olive CVC dry out. And we'll see. Just make some drifts blind while I'm waiting for one to rise. There's a better fish that keeps moving up further. That's, oh, look at that fish. All right, here we go. This is the one. Got it. <laughs> that fish has been rising the whole time I've been in this pool. Oh, chill out, mate. Beautiful. Ah, oh, I so wish we had a European grayling in Australia. Thank you, mate. Straight back to the bottom and go. There's a lot of food coming down through there. I can see some small mayfly and other stuff. Got it. That's the one I was looking for. That's a better fish. It was riding, rising so beautifully. It's got the beautiful dorsal fin out there in the water. Look at that. Oh, that is a lovely fish. Such a fat grayling. He's going to flip out. But look at that beautiful <laughs> dorsal fin on it. That's great. All right, I'm going to go throw nymph under dry as the water's getting deeper. Caught a few on the dry, which is single dry, which is really fun. All right, I'm going to throw the uh, nymph under dryer just to see. Well, just to see, really. I think the fish will eat the nymph. Like that, yeah. That's a nice fish. Amazing how when they rise, sometimes even a very, very lightly weighted nymph can undo them. All right, we're gonna work up. Just nymph under dry, we've got some really nice broken mixed water here. Got him. Oh, don't go there, buddy. Thanks. Bummer. Gotcha. Thank you, Mr. Fish. Got you as well. Oh, just pulled. Dang. <clears throat> Got 
Gotcha. That was a lovely take. Nice grayling. Thank you, mate. water here looks lovely like that <laughs> when you get that just yeah nice broken top thank you mr. grayling there just there lovely cool fish Let's see if there is a bigger one up in here Oh. That's a nice take, same size fish. <laughs> oh, just popped off. A nice little eye here. Oh, did you see that fish just eat that dry beautifully? Cannot get enough of these beautiful grayling. Look at the dry in the mouth there. That is absolutely awesome. Well, I hope you all enjoyed seeing uh, that little snippet into some of the fishing I've been enjoying here in Slovakia. It's been absolutely amazing. Um, dry fly, nymphing, nymph under dry, lots of grayling. Uh, this, I did actually catch a trout in this like, you know, 100 meters that I fished just then, which was really surprising because the other day on this river, I didn't catch so many grayling and there were heaps and heaps of trout, but uh, that's fishing, so. As always, uh, don't forget to like the video if you did, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Remember, links to the gear, flies, all of that, it's in the description below. Check that out, and uh, I'll see you next video.